Therefore they shall come and sing in the height of Zion. Then shall the virgin rejoice in the dance, both young men and old together, for I will turn their mourning into joy and make them rejoice in their sorrow. That is from Jeremiah 31, verses 12 to 13, describing the conditions that will be in the world tomorrow after Christ's return. The World Tomorrow. The Worldwide Church of God presents Herbert W. Armstrong, internationally recognized ambassador for world peace, visiting prominent leaders around the globe, discussing the cause of world problems, and proclaiming the good news of the world tomorrow. Ladies and gentlemen, Herbert W. Armstrong. That scripture is a prophecy in Jeremiah 31, speaking of the world tomorrow under the new covenant that God will make after the second coming of Christ, after his return to earth. This program cries out with the good news of Christ's true gospel the kingdom of God, which is the announcement of the coming happy, joyful, peaceful world tomorrow. This program is sponsored by the Worldwide Church of God, which also operates Ambassador College, with a campus in Pasadena and a campus in Big Sandy, Texas. The youth of today in this world ordinarily seek fun in drugs, in alcohol, in rock music, I prefer to call it noise, in illicit sex, in violence. We try to teach a different way in Ambassador College we try to teach that there is fun in a better way than that. In the kingdom of God, when people will be living God's way, there will be entertainment, but it'll be uplifting, it'll be clean and wholesome and good. Now, the Worldwide Church of God annually holds the largest festival on the face of the earth. It's held in 49 different nations, different countries all over the world where more than 100,000 people gather in many, many different feast sites or festival sites to get a foretaste of that world tomorrow when everything will be happy and peaceful, uplifting, and also very productive. I show you now portions of a film that has been produced by Ambassador College students and by our own television facilities and our television crew on campus at Pasadena. And now I want to show you a few sequences from one of these films that have been shown in our festivals all over the world to our own members. I'd like to have you enjoy it with us.
Samba from Mexico. I've no idea in the world how it goes. Da 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 da. It goes like that. Play the bacata and goo. Play a little boo boo. Play the Dutchman rhapsody. Throw in a Brahms lullaby or two. A song from 1910. We play a song sounding like Big Ben. Da 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 da. It goes like that.
looking swell. Yes, well, darling, we can tell. Can tell, darling, you're still going. Somebody take her rap, fellas. Find her an empty lap. Fellas, Dolly will never go away. Dolly will never go away. Hello, hello, hello. Before the parade passes by, I'm gonna go and taste Saturday's hard life. Before the parade.
Last night I lay sleeping. There came a dream so fair. I stood in old Jerusalem beside the temple there. I heard the children singing, and ever as they sang, methought the voice of angels from heaven answering. Methought the voice of angels. The streets no longer ran. Hushed were the glad hosannas the little children sang. The sky grew dark with mystery, the morn was cold and chill. As the shadow of a stake arose upon a lonely hill, as the shadow. Now I want to offer you 
absolutely free, a booklet about the world tomorrow. They've just been picturing to you a concept of some of the happiness and the joy that we'll see in the world tomorrow. The wonderful world tomorrow, what it will be like. It's well illustrated in color. It'll give you something that you have never known before and what biblical prophecies say, and it's absolutely certain. <clears throat> now also, I would like to send you and especially the youth that may have been listening, our magazine published for youth, for teenagers. It's called Youth 83. There's no magazine like it at all on earth. Now, the opening article is one that I wrote. I wrote this 56 years ago, back in 1927. What's wrong with a younger generation? You'll get a kick out of that because it's funny and it's interesting. Now here's another one. The headline is, come on, try it, it won't hurt you. Here's another one, one grand canyon with some beautiful photographs in color of the grand canyon. But now listen, this is for young people even up to 80 or 90 years of age, and I'm already past 90. And I find it interesting. I find it very interesting at all ages. You just send your request to me, Herbert W. Armstrong, at Pasadena, California. That's all the address you need, just Herbert W. Armstrong, Pasadena, California, and the zip code is 91123. Or call toll-free. Dial 800-423-4444. Now it's 423-4444. Then, if you do live in California, Alaska, or Hawaii, call Collect, area code 213-304-6111. Area code 213, the number 304-6111. So, until next time, Herbert W. Armstrong, goodbye, friends. For the free literature offered on this program, write Herbert W. Armstrong, Pasadena, California, 91123. In Canada, Box 44, Vancouver, B.C. Or in the continental United States, you may call this toll-free number, 800-423-4444. In California, Alaska, and Hawaii, call Collect 213-304-6111. If the lines are busy, please try again. The preceding program and all literature were produced and sponsored by the Worldwide Church of God.